All right, here we have a level two exam question where we need to drag these event, these uh, activities, into this timetable so that it meets certain criteria. Let's have a quick read through. Lois is in a holiday resort. She wants to book some activities for tomorrow. Lois wants to do one activity in the morning, one activity in the afternoon, and one activity in the evening. She wants the activities too. Last more than four hours in total. Cost between 50 and 55 pounds in total and you need to choose three activities for Lois and complete the totals. Uh, so if we pick one morning activity, let's pick uh, the zip wire sounds quite cool. Let's do the zip wire. In the afternoon we can do uh, mini golf and in the evening we can do go-karts, laser quest or tennis. Let's have a nice lovely little game of tennis. Okay, uh, this we might have got lucky. Our first guess might have been the one that works. It's not likely, but it could happen. So let's check all the times, check the cost, see if it works. Uh, now I've spotted a problem that might come up with the time. She wants the activities to last more than four hours in total, but when we add these numbers up our answer will be in minutes and we need to put minutes in here because it wants the time in minutes. So it might make sense at this stage to convert this four hours into minutes so that I know what number I'm aiming for down here. If there are 60 minutes in one hour then there'd be two lots of 60 minutes in two hours, three lots of 60 in three hours, and four lots of 60 in four hours. So I'm going to do 60 times four for four hours. All right, I'm just gonna make a note of that. And as you can see, there's nowhere to put working out on here, so there's nowhere that you need to show this. This is just to help us out. I'm gonna say that this four hours is 240 mins. That's just, just, just a note for us. Uh, okay, so now I want to work out what these add up to together, see if they're the right time. We've got 45 minutes for the zip wire, 95 minutes for the afternoon activity, and 90 minutes for an evening game of tennis, which is 230 minutes so far, which is too short. It doesn't last long enough. Now, before I swap anything out, um, I'm sorry, I'm going to make a note of that, just so that at the moment we know that this is too short. Uh, and let's just see what the cost is like as well, so we know what we're looking for when we swap out one of these activities for something different. So the cost so far, we're at £17.59 for the zip wire, plus £12.79 for the mini golf, and £14.89. Okay, so the reason why I wanted to add this up, even though I know this is already not going to work, is because now I can see that it's also too cheap. This doesn't cost enough money. So when I swap something out of here, I'm looking for something that's an activity that is longer, lasts a longer time, and costs more money. So uh, since it's the first one on there, let's swap out the morning, because it's also the shortest one. So if I can swap that out for something longer, I'll have fixed this problem. I'm going to take it out and swap it for either quad bikes or wall climbing. Well, quad bike sounds a little bit more exciting, so we'll swap it out for quad bikes. Now this was a good choice because yes, it was longer, we were at 45 minutes before and now we're at 60 and it also costs more money so it might have solved both of our problems let's add it up and see what we get so the time we're aiming for 240 or more oh, sorry it has to be more than 240 so 241 is fine 240 not good enough uh, 60 for the quad bikes plus 95 for the mini golf plus 90 okay so we're just over we're at 245 I'm going to type that in in case this ends up being the correct, a correct solution. Uh, and let's check the cost. It needs to be between 50 and 55. Well, we're at 25.99 for the quad bikes, and we have 12.79 for the mini golf, and 14.89 for the tennis. Ah, perfect. Okay, so it costs 53 pounds 67 in total. It only took us two tries there to get the right answer. But if this was still too expensive, for example, we know this is quite close to being uh, not long enough. So if this was to cost too much money, I'd be looking to swap out something that's a similar amount of time but costs a bit less. There are methodic methodical ways of doing things, and if you get really stuck, you can just drag it all out and start again, providing you have time. But try and think about the problem with your sequence. You know, is it, does it last too long? Is it too short? Cost too much money? Is it too cheap? and try and swap out the activities so that you fix one of those problems. And it might create another one, but that is a methodical way of answering this type of question.